Hope you're having a great Sunday. Jordan Trask here for the 12th, I think that's right, day of Christmas. For my 25 days of Christmas where I'm literally just doing random strategies for random businesses for every day of the month up till Christmas. And what we're gonna do is try to keep it holiday themed, maybe, we'll see. And uh, you know, we wanna focus on TV commercials and a little bit more high-end stuff, just so I'm not being dainty with this type of thing. And then we wanna focus on uh, things that help the business sustain down the road, not just get money, make money, uh, earn some revenue during the holiday season. So today, the 12th day, I'm almost halfway there, I drew life coach and you know, I've been talking about just random indust industries in the last you know week that I've been getting, uh, like yesterday was soap. I think, you know, I'm not even gonna try to run them down. You run down them, you go watch them yourself. But um, this one, <laughs> this one kind of takes the cake because how, what life coach would even promote during the holidays? I don't know. I've never actually seen an ad. I did a life skills coaching class in college. Um, I've talked to a few life coaches. Um, and it typically, at least in my experience, I'm not sure, they typically focus on younger people or people trying to figure stuff out, typically right before college, and help them find out what their passion is, what their skill set is, you know, what they love to do, what they're good at, what they were made for, right? And so, um, but life skill coaching does, it's not, it's not just about that, you know, um, trying to understand it a little bit more. It's, it's helping you get the right skills to round out things. It's helping you understand life, right? It's helping you progress, overcome certain things that maybe you're not able to on your own based on what you've been equipped uh, throughout your life up to this point or the experiences that you have or your upbringing, all these different things that limit us or, or you know, give us blinders uh, to the reality of life. Um, you know, and when I think about the holidays, just, just with what that means, I think a lot of times we can be limited just by what's right in front of us or our current situation. And I think Initially, there's so many people that are either, um, I know you could probably find people in the middle, but for the most part, you're either tremendously blessed, right? And you're blessing others, or you're really struggling during the holidays. And both of those two types of people are kind of glaring in our society. And uh, when you are maybe struggling, like I've been there before myself, my family, with a big family, it's a huge burden that it can you can feel like a failure. Um, it's hard to not compare. Um, it's hard to not... Uh, you know, be completely depressed, especially as a man uh, during the holiday season, um, you know, when you're struggling. Uh, and then, you know, just on the flip side of that, um, it's, it's hard to see, uh, you know, when you, when you do have a lot of money, it's hard to understand what that struggle might look like. Or if you've, you've kind of had a silver spoon your whole life or you've never really been, uh, you know, I don't want to say hit rock bottom, <laughs> but I guess hit rock bottom for business or in your career where you've kind of had to scrape the crumbs. Not everybody's had to actually do that, so being able to have that perspective is tough. Um, but when, when you are struggling, it, it can be easy to look at people and judge them or covet, right, and, and have these desires or, or on top of feeling depressed or low or like a failure, right? Um, so when it comes to a life coach, I'm gonna go ahead and assume that those types of people are the people that I wanna target. Not not <laughs> like to throw salt on a wound, right? That, hey, you're really struggling with this, let me remind you. But to, to do it in a more of an encouraging way to say, hey, you're not, an, you're not alone. Uh, the things that you're dealing with, the hindrances that you have or the obstacles that you have or the um, uh, stuff that you're seeking out of life right now that you're missing, uh, everybody does. It's just not everybody sees it that way. And I think finances, money, uh, really gives us blinders to mention that again on the reality of life. And um, there's, it's, life is so much deeper than that with emotions and fulfillment and relationships and um, your ability to retain and teach, right? There's all different types of things that go into life that help us uh, determine or uh, describe or define our life as successful or a failure, right? Or uh, depressing or happy. Um, and our inability or our, our uh, refusal to, or lack of desire to find the fulfillment or true joy and chase happiness can be uh, fleeting to say the least. So I'm kind of rambling on this. I, I love psychology. So this is something that's fresh always in my mind. And I have so many kids, so I'm always lecturing about something. So I'm sorry about that. But <laughs> um Life coaching is about that. Life skill coaching, um, it's about 
not only just holding people accountable, but building them up. You got to tear things down to build it back back up and you got to make sure the foundation is solid. If that foundation is bad, you got to kind of put a couple pieces or pull a couple pieces out. So I'm thinking of, you know, a really, a really high uh, performing commercial would be something that's really intimate like this or very uh, touching or even very direct, uh, you know, with with just calling somebody out. And I'm thinking, you know, somebody's maybe watching a sports game or maybe watching a parade or something during the holidays or a movie and they come across this, hey, are you dealing with this or dealing with this or dealing with this? Well, everybody deals with this, even, yeah, the successful guy down the street. And matter of fact, the successful entrepreneur, the millionaire, probably could use some help on this too. It's not just you. It just happens to be that your finances aren't in, in order. Um, and try to do more of a talk, talking to that person. And, you know, you could do narration like <laughs> the pharmaceutical companies do or or other industries do to try to... To create relevancy, but I think it needs to be that coach. You know, like for me, if I'm doing a pre-focus commercial, it needs to be me. You need to see me. You need to believe in me. You need to feel me, and you need to understand what I'm saying and teaching you. Because um, it's kind of cool. And you know, once I really sit, and, you know, just kind of think about this, that pre-focus really is kind of that life skill element of of marketing of of business. You know, you maybe you don't know what you're doing. Maybe you've been taught wrong. Maybe you see somebody else doing something. And you want to do it or chase it and you can't because you're not that person and being able to see everything from a bird's eye view, right? And what moving pieces you have and putting them together, chess piece, if you will, to make sure that the strategy functions at a high level. Um, sometimes it's just so, so simple to do, but we could be so stubborn to not get the help that we need or maybe not want to pay for that help. So we keep trying to do it ourselves and then we, we continue to stumble in the same ways. And so... I think anyways, I'm getting a little bit off topic. So I would try to do a commercial that shows a bunch of different types of people that are really struggling during the holidays. Maybe mentally, maybe you lost somebody to a disease or illness, right? Maybe you lost your job. Um, maybe you didn't get that bonus check. Maybe, you know, you're divorced and you don't get to see your kids. Um, you know, maybe uh, you had to take a new job and you're working during the holidays, right? Uh, maybe you're just in a place of limbo. Maybe you've been saved, right? And everything's different. Uh, as far as, uh, you know, with Christ and with God and stuff. And, and you see the world different during Christmas and all these things. And, and so things can change so fast in life. And, and each one of our uh, situations are all different. So trying to really talk at somebody and tell somebody what they need is really ignorant. And, and at the end of the day, uh, creating a commercial that's engaging, that's real, that's real stories, that's with a real person that you could see that can help you, that you can believe in and buy into and creating a setting um, that's just like that, you know, maybe just like this sitting I have right now. It's, it's in my living room. It's, it's comfortable. It's bright. Um, I'm comfortable. This is in my element and I'm talking to you cause I'm, it's Sunday, you know, right? I, I got a chili cook off. We're getting ready to go to later today. I got stuff to do, but I want to help you. I want to promote this stuff. I don't want to just make money. I want to help you make money, um, so that I can be a part of that. And, um, you know, that's my approach. That's my strategy. I never waver from that. And with life coach, you know, you want to be able to encompass that into a uh, communicative form of messaging for television that resonates with your target audience in as many ways as you can. And I think um, that you want to make, make it centered on the simple fact that joy and peace, right, and uh, silent nights and all these things that that's what the holidays are about right enjoying time with family being thankful for what you have giving even if you don't have a lot of things um, that's what it's all about you don't have you don't have to compare and contrast you don't have to envy uh, you know Joe Schmo down the street that has two Corvettes you know a motorcycle and a boat and and you have a little beat-up Honda who cares because that guy may be struggling more than you everybody has issues with life skills or life's challenges or life's moments, right? And being able to overcome that with somebody else that cares, to slingshot you forward, to be a not only just to be a better version of you, but impact those that you come across and maybe your family and stuff. Um, that stuff is so important. So that's what I would do for a life skill coach is, is talk about the holidays in the tough the tough parts of the holidays, right? The strain of the holidays. The stress, maybe the finances, the struggle, um, but the joy and peace that can be had if you're thankful and understand right where you are. And everybody's right, is everybody's somewhere, 
and most cases not everybody uh, nobody is where they want to be right so just reminding people of that in general and saying hey there's a guy that's just like you or there I was in your shoes one day or I had a client that did this have some testimonials that stuff is huge um, because we get so caught up in especially in America these days where we got to sell at people tell people what they need tell people who they are tell people what they're doing wrong instead of trying to just connect with them right uh, and we don't want to assume we don't want to judge but we want to say hey I know I do know these things I do know that these problems uh, these are common problems during the holidays of people because I help a lot of people and if you're dealing with this I want you to know I can help you too and it's not because I'm trying to close you on this and I need more money for the holidays so that I can enjoy my big life of a lifestyle <laughs> life skills coach and all the fruit that that brings but no it's because I want to help you that's where I find my fulfillment and joy during the holidays and matter of fact I do some pro bono sessions where I got this free gift or this free advice or this downloadable on my website that I'm giving away now for the holidays to help you get through it to help you pass it around to help you be more influential to help you uh, be a better leader uh, and a better giver, better father, better mom, better sister, better brother during the holidays, right? Better citizen. Um, and that's really all life skills is. Um, it may be people just coming out of college. Maybe that's where most people hire them. Maybe somebody that's uh, getting ready to become an entrepreneur, quit their job. Maybe you get a life skills coach along with your business coach. I don't know. I really don't know anything at all about that. Um, you know, I, I've always had mentors that are uh, pastors and stuff, and I go to, to God and the Word and all and, and prayer and stuff when I struggle, and the Spirit helps me. But uh, most people, and even myself, almost all people I can confidently say need somebody else to talk to, to, to bounce things off of, um, and, and that body of people that uh, that you can come to and rely on. and. Um, not everybody has that, and and unfortunately, sometimes you got to pay for it. But um, if you could find a way to have touch points where people don't have to pay for pay for it, and you can uh, um, expand your value during Christmas season, then I think that that would be a really cool cool thing to do, and a really uh, that would some, be something that I would have a lot of respect for. So. Um, you know, not not just we don't want to just think of holiday campaigns and Easter campaigns and Fourth of July campaigns and all this stuff. That's just this cheesy or traditional or um, just basic relevant stuff. We want to try to create a memory. We want to try to create trust, elicit loyalty, right? And we want to try to build up the value of our brand. If we're not giving value, we're not sharing something with our marketing, our info commercials is what they should be called. Um, and it's just sales, 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 or just telling and telling and telling and instead of sharing uh, uh, or showing, right? Uh, do show and tell marketing. If you're not doing that, then then you're just, it's a one-way conversation and you're giving a person a chance to say yes or no. Let them adopt it, let them believe in it, and let them support you, and, and most importantly, let them make, make it, allow it to be their choice. I'm going to stop talking now. Be purposeful with everything you do. If you're a life skill coach, try it. If it works, don't even have to pay me. Just give me a message in my DM. And always remember to pre-focus.